Hey everybody, welcome back to this channel. In today's video, we're going to talk about on how to solve the brightness issues on a Raymond Mac which is running the Mac OS Monterey. Now imagine you're at work and suddenly you see that your brightness goes up and down. At the same time, people are also complaining that their brightness goes really dim at the startup screen. Also people are complaining that their brightness just getting automatically adjusted and at the same time people are also saying their Mac brightness slider is missing on their touch bar and their keyboard brightness option is not working. So if you are experiencing any of this problem whatsoever, don't worry, because in this video we're going to show you the complete guidelines on how to solve this problem. Alright guys, so the first things you have to do, you need to click on your Apple logo and come down to your system preference and afterward click on your display. Now on your display, the first things you have to do, you need to check this mark. If you see the automatically adjust brightness is turned on, go ahead and turn it off and just choose your brightness, I mean adjust it by yourself. After doing that, and make sure your true tone is turned on. Now, right after doing this, all you have to do is just go ahead and cross it out, click on your Apple logo again, come down here, and click Restart. Alright guys, now after restart, go ahead and check whether your problem is solved or not. If you see still, you're experiencing the same problem, the next things you have to do, just once again, click on your Apple logo, come down to your system preference, and then just go to your display again, and right afterward, you need to choose your color profile. Now, here you're going to see a lot of profile already available, now you can choose either display P3 or you can choose color LCD. The best thing that we recommend you to do, just simply customize the brightness label that you literally want. If you come down to customize options, simply click on plus and afterward click on the continue. Now click continue and here just simply unmark it and choose your color label. Can I hear you can just you set this up the way you want and then once you have chosen your color, simply click use navigate white point, click continue now go ahead and click here to allow other users to use this calibration. Now click continue, click continue again, now click done and afterward you're going to be able to use your profile right afterward. Now go ahead and just click on here, click done and then you're good to go. Well, if the previous process didn't work for you and the next process you want to do, you need to refresh the core brightness options on your M1 Mac. If you click here on your uh, spotlight search and type activity monitor. Now click on your activity monitor and afterward just click CPU and click on the search option and first type core and then type brightness. Now here you're going to see your core brightness option is right here. Now after coming here, click on sample and then just enter your password. Now click OK. Now click refresh and now you're good to go. Now after refreshing your core brightness options on your M1 Mac, your problem should be solved. If it doesn't, the next things you just quickly go ahead and take a look at is your update. If you click on your Apple logo here, click on about this Mac and make sure to click on software update. If you found out the new software available for your M1 Mac, go ahead and update it to solve your problem every time Apple fix their bugs and glitches with their new software update. So make sure to update it to solve your problem. Alright guys, so this is how you can solve your brightness issue on your M1 Mac with macOS Monterey. Hope you find this video useful. If so, drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you all later.